happy, happy, be healthy fam. Welcome back to my Instagram, blog, or my YouTube channel, whichever you happen to be watching right now. I'm Shelby. I'm super stoked you're joining me here today for this stretch and recovery video. Yes, I'm so excited. I do a lot of high intensity toning, sculpting videos on my pages. Um, so that's what my workout routines normally consist of. But I wanted to show a little bit of behind the scenes of what I do uh, after my workouts, the go-to stretches that I really, really enjoy and that I feel like I get the most uh, results from. So it's so important, just a little bit of physiology as a background for why we stretch and recover and kind of what happens when we actually exercise. I get this question a lot. Um, so what happens when you work out is you're tearing down, you're making microscopic tears in your muscle fibers. And once you tear those, these things called satellite cells, they go to the repair of those muscle fibers and they rebuild them stronger, which is what shows the physical size difference or um, the strengthening of your muscles. That's what is creating that because it's making like, when you have scar tissue, sometimes it's tougher like than normal tissue. That's kind of the same, like that is kind of like a thought process
that I give you guys. These work, these little stretches help to work those muscles and elongate them in such a nice way. So great. So we're gonna do the same thing. We're about middle. Bend that left leg. Flex that right foot. Make sure the knee's over the foot. Don't go past it. like to do this and stretch out the back. Whatever you want to do. Walk the feet in. Take a minute here. Shake out your arms. Move the next side to side. Bend the knees and slowly. Here's the sitting stretches that I always like to do. Just your basic forward fold. I'm grabbing my toes, flexing them. This is my calves which I really, really love. Coming on down to your back. Bridges, always super nice. But when you do bridges, make sure to pay attention to just one thing, okay? Paint the spine. So pull that belly button down to the floor and just like slowly, like your back is tape, like your back is made of tape and you're slowly pulling the tape off of the mat. And then you're slowly putting it back down one vertebrae at a time. That lower back goes through a lot too with ab exercises, with hits, with everything. So it's so important to really stretch that spine out. Also, if you're standing at your job a lot the whole day, or if you're sitting at a desk the whole day, you really want to make sure you're getting recovery to that lower back. On down all the way down so all the way down and we're gonna do a little cobra action I'm sure a lot of people love this one so cobra up make sure your shoulders aren't here press them down away from your face nice and long nice and long
go-to stretches that I love to do after all my workouts, after some of my workouts, and make sure you guys give them a try, okay? Make sure you comment below and let me know how you like it, and I'll see you next time.